do a nice dial change, spruce it up a little bit, single row, big pointers around there, available very soon. AP Offshore, Worth Avenue Edition, 100 pieces worldwide, this is number 15. Yeah, yeah. yeah. What are you paying for them now? Because I mean, this continues. Come on, trotters. Uh, I'll be honest, I don't really need one of them. I've got a two, but yeah, they're, 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 they're good as gold. What year was your one again? No, I'm not really making Yeah, yeah, listen, you're fucking good as gold. What'd you pay for that? Like late 50s, wasn't it? 50s. Oh, no, they were 10 now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You'll be sweet. What are they going for? Well, I've got, I've got a 2016. I've seen that one over there. Yeah, exactly. So it'd be, it'd be, it's, it's, it's worth around that money, if I'm honest. Yeah, Sam, man. Well, good investment from you, Sam. Yeah, man. Come on, trotters all the time, bro. Always, always. Come on, man. Go on, Sam. No worries. Um, if, if you if you want to buy one, let me know. Yeah, yeah I'll shout you. I'll put your number saved anyway. I'll shout you. Yeah. Sam, okay, sweet bro. Thank you very much. Take care. Sweet bro. Bye, bye, bye. Right. Just having a look. Yeah. Um, have you got any? Have you got any back girl or anything like that? I have. Yeah, I've got one. Yeah. Well, 2021 one. Yeah. Uh, box and papers. How much is this today? Uh, that's 21.4. We've got a Pepsi as well, that just coming on the weekend. All box and papers, are Yeah, they? majority of these will be box and papers. If they haven't got box, if they haven't got papers, I'd obviously say TR. Yeah, uh, yeah, which yeah. one has or which one hasn't. I understand. But yeah. So how much are, today, how much is that? Uh, well, buying it outright, 10 and a half. If you wanted to part exit, it'd be 11. Right. It always no, warrants a little bit more when you part exit. So yeah, it'd be 20, uh, 11, you'd have to give me 10,500 more. 10,500. If you try and go for a sports model, because I think they're probably the most popular, common investment watches, probably go for like just a normal sub date. I just think you're safe with them. Hmm. You know, I think your money's always going to be safe with them. As in, you can take that anywhere around the world and someone will buy it because it's just the most recognisable Rolex. Yeah. I'd then also say maybe go for like a biometal one. So you can get like the Still and Gold Submariners, yeah. the GMTs, yeah. Blue yeah. Submariners, the Black Submariners. Yeah. They're going to be like around your 15 grand, or 15 grand mark. When you start going like 20 over, then you might be able to go for like Pepsi's, the new, the new Starbucks, the new Skydwellers. Yeah. They're probably the better ones to go for, but you obviously only want to stick to what you want to spend. So if you look at like the Batgirls, the Hulks, the Starbucks, the Pepsi, they're all over 20K. Whereas these, well, these yachts here, you can pick up for around like 16 and a half, 17 grand still. They've not gone up as much yeah. after the No, that's it. They've got room to follow. I don't know. Okay, do we sack Tom? I know. Is, did the picture sell it, or was it me behind? Yeah, or was it was it was it the, was it the gorgeous watch? Got a bit or was it blurry character behind? Or was it Judd holding it? Is there an echo in there? Oh, Factory, uh, yellow ruby. No, there was a few. That it so discontinued. With Hello. service card. No, I've got two now. You got two. You I've sold got one. Nineteen and the seventeen. We was asking 16, 16 and a half and 17 grand, I think it was. Yeah, sharp that. I saw it on your Instagram. Yeah. I've just bought a load at the moment, so it's not one I really need. Okay. Because yeah. if I'm, if I'm it would help me out. Obviously. Yeah, yeah, no, of course. Yeah. I mean, you could, listen, you could try and sell that uh, yeah. somewhere in Hatton Garden or somewhere like that. Yeah, yeah. Just the jewellery district in London, it's about 10 minutes from here. Okay. There's loads and loads of shops around there, though, like different okay. jewellery shops. Just so take, go garden. try Hat and Garden, that's yeah. my best advice. Yeah, cool. See what they've got around there. Yeah. Bus it, bus it, bus it. There's actually a cancelled order, but um, this is a cheap watch. So since we've cancelled the order, or the customer cancelled the order, the watch value has actually gone up a thousand pound. I know it's got diamonds on, but the plain value of the watch has gone up. So therefore it cost us more to set it up. So kind of a win-win on that Another bussy out the door. Summer's coming, baby. I said it before. If you're interested, hit me up. Wow, first quarter gone like that. Still feels like it was Christmas last week. 
Uh, yeah, it's been a busy one. Thankfully, it's half term now, so things might quieten down a little bit. Recharge our batteries. Obviously, I've been off ill. I was ripped off for about a week, <laughs> but I'm back. Um, yeah, I don't know. Time to get hair cut, beard cut, new ideas. I've got something quite cool working in the pipeline, but we're not going to announce anything yet until it's like 100% confirmed. Um, maybe next quarter you'll see some of the new Rolex models that have come out. Maybe we'll get some hands in some of them, so that'd be quite cool. You guys have got I style bro, uh, Datejust, yeah? yeah? 17, I think we got it up for. Okay. So I'm, I definitely need to cut, leave here with a watch today. I want a nice style one. I've got one I want to trade in as well, but obviously it just depends what you guys can Have offer. you got it with you, the one you want to trade yeah, yeah, yeah. in? Yeah, can I have a look? Yeah. yeah. He's got flowers yeah. and bezels, so he's got multiple stones, but the other one has got boogers, like you said. Sweet, was it same setting? Uh, same setting, yeah. It's hard to see on that one, but it'd be the same yeah. case setting. It's yeah, hard yeah, to yeah. see the price difference, but yeah, same. Yeah, no, this is proper still. I like this one. This one here is more the old school setting. Yeah. How much are you asking for this one? Uh, that one is 16, 50. 16? What change? What do you reckon the Oyster Base or the Jubilee? Well, how much is the Dweller? Uh, 29.5. 29.5. Do you know what? Yeah, we'll just do the deal on that watch. Yeah? Yeah, the, the one that you're coming back on Sorry. Thursday. Sorry. Day date 40, stunning, stunning piece. In my eyes, this is probably better than the Olive RBR. So it's another team dinner for the Trotters crew, celebrating someone's birthday. 21 at midnight. I don't think we've got anything yet though. Have we got a present yet, Cal? Your love Keeping is just enough. enough. Yeah. We ain't got a yeah. present. Yeah, going out tonight is a present. Yeah. <laughs> We're paying for a meal tonight, so that's a fucking 21st present for us. We've got my favourite, probably ever watch, the Wimbledon. I think it's my lucky watch, to be honest. First watch I sold. How often do you get these in? Uh, they are quite popular, but we get more of the stainless in, don't we, Rio? Really? So we struggle to get. More the oyster bracelet than the Jubilee. Jubilee is quite hard. Yeah. He's going for Wimbledon. That's Lovely choice. Yeah. That one is nice. It's nice, ain't it? Yeah, I've got the tiniest wrist as well, so I don't know if it's going 36 or 41. Do you want to try 36 on, just for sizing? Could I? Yeah, right, of course you can. Yeah, Do you like the Jubilee or the Oyster? The Jubilee. Jubilee, yeah. I'm not, that won't be what's weighing me, not the size. Maybe. Try them on. I think some people are quite shocked how reasonable the size of the 41 is on the wrist. I think it shocks them sometimes when they try it on. I think gonna, they think it's going to be bigger than it is. More factory, yellow gold, day date two, ruby doll, factory, diamond bezel. Like I said before, I'm not a fan of yellow, but there are some yellow watches that I would wear, and this is one of them. Ruby Dial for me is one of the best Rolex dials that ever existed. The only one that beats it is the Meteor. Oil. Boom. Just sold. Royal Oak Offshore, limited edition, limited to 100 pieces. Just sold this to a client from whereabouts? Oklahoma. 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 USA. USA. Before anyone starts taking a piss. <laughs> Big chunky for me, is that? No, it's from Oklahoma. Stay, it's too much. Stay. Easy. Initially, I had about 30 in mind, but like, obviously, I'm nice a bit more. You guys Cal, do you want to sell yours? That's 50, isn't it? I don't know, but. That's uh, 50, isn't it? The next size down would be a 39 mil, but unfortunately for prices, it's probably more or less the same. Right, 15,300, yeah. Yeah, it won't be much different. So so the, like 30k is a sky dollar range, but a sky dollar is a chunky watch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So if you don't want a chunky watch, I don't know what else is. Uh... I've got one. Mm. Like Judd said, you get a 39 mil, it ends up being the same sort of money. You're better off more value for money in the 41 mil. Um, other than that, 
That's probably the slimmest AP line as well, because you get the offshore, they're massive. We just done that one there. And it's just like, that'd be, ch that'd be really chunky for you. Put around the way you don't see these often, do you? Yeah, really? mad, didn't it? Another yellow gold watch. <laughs> Wasn't a fan, but stunning one, this one. Yellow gold GMT or yellow gold sub? What are you going for? Rolex or AP? AP. Patek or AP? AP. Day date or Daytona? Day date. Uh, fluid or smooth? Depends on which watch. Uh, steel and gold or stainless steel? Stainless steel. Jubilee or Oyster? Ooh, Jubilee. Favourite bit of merch that Trotters has released? Favourite bit of merch? Sorry, Fred, but I like the original hats. <laughs> 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 Literally. The ones with like the little trotters on the inside. Even though I'm ripping this hat right now, but yeah. Um, Callum or Alex? <laughs> I'm gonna go with my homeboy. Don't worry, yeah. No, we're gonna school together, so you can't. Bust down on Miami. Bust down on Plain Jane. Bust down in Miami, Plain Jane every day. <laughs> well, well, of course, on in Miami. Um. Favourite footballer that's come up here? Favourite footballer? Wow. Out of politeness, I'm actually going to say Mustafi, but I think our top boy is obviously Jack Grealish. Ah, Mustafi, I don't know. You've made me feel uncomfortable now. I don't know. It's got to be Jack, though, isn't it, really? 28 mil or 26 mil? For ladies, mm -hmm. 31 mil. Good answer. Don't, don't say it. We only got two here. Fucking hell. 26. Uh, Batman. Pepsi. GMT or something? GMT. GMT. Uh, Jubilee or um, presidential? Presidential. Favourite day date? Favourite day date ever? Platinum day date, 40 of the baguette blue iced on the doll. Good answer. I've run out of questions now. <laughs> Oh, Michael, I'm saying, eh? Whoa! That's not what you get to. Oh, I get to up. I hate myself. I'm not having that one. I'm not having that one. You own it, bro. You don't do it. I'm not having that one. So, no names, just locked in a deal, no prices, no names, the, uh, the new lefty coming in, first one in the UK, first Riddler, first Sprite in the UK. <laughs>
sorry, sorry, Joe, you sound awful. I thought you were a bloody pal or something. Joe, you Mikey, I'm not being on the YouTube anymore because you get bad angles of me, from me personally. That was Callum. Don't care. How much? So Tilly, you're doing this on company time, yeah? No. It's nine minutes past five. <laughs> <laughs>